Welcome back, people. Hope you're doing very well for yourselves. From all of us, we hope your week has been filled with content and progress. As Philip Morawski would say, never let a good crisis go to waste. However, I haven't really been doing much myself. I'm planning to have exhausted Netflix by the time we're done. Uh, if anyone can suggest me any documentaries, I'd love to watch them. Don't suggest any series, though, because I will not be checking those out. You know when someone says, like, yeah, you should watch this series, and then you're like, yeah, I'll watch that series, and then you never bother. That's me. But documentaries I can deal with. Yesterday I watched uh, Apollo 11 about the moon landings in 1969. It's fantastic. It's all the original footage from, from 50 years ago and there's no voiceovers or anything and it's just HD footage from, from back in the day and it's really cool. Also, say hi to Ross Bob 1 and Ross Bob 2 very important boys. Otherwise, the last few days have been pretty mundane. Um, I've been grooming the cats a lot. Uh, I've been combing them and giving them loads of cuddles. Uh, I've also been researching sloths. They're amazing creatures. Did you know that a sloth can run faster than a human when it wants to? That is not true. But my cactus, Judah, has been decapitated for his war crimes. But luckily he's healing, so yay! We're gonna check up on Magnus and see how he's doing. Hey, spent this morning getting this ready, so I've now got all these wonderful little things that I can... Chris um, finally released a music video for Stealing Hearts. Very moving video. <laughs> I'll just leave him, leave him going for it. So I can't let him turn the fucking screen off. I wrote some new music. I've got my stream coming up from when this video releases. I'm doing an acoustic thing tomorrow on Clunk's Instagram TV channel. There'll be some Kazakh songs, non-Kazakh songs as well. And now I've got all this set up, I can I can do it on our own channel as well, which I'll start doing maybe on the Friday. Good news, um, my sister got over coronavirus, she's now better, and none of us have it at the moment. I have no idea if that's gonna change over the next few weeks. We'll find out. Um, I finished off the ER recordings. I might go over those a little bit at some point on a video. Like the different guitar parts and stuff are quite cool. How they all like texture together because I think it's one of those things that you don't really think about when you listen to music. But if you want to see any of that then let me know. Jack's been trying to get me to film this video for ages and I'm so bad at it. It's the worst. It's the best. It's great because I like being able to be in the videos but it's so weird sitting in front of a camera and trying to like speak like a normal human being. And let's see how Reese is doing. Hello, Reese. Hello, Jack. How are you doing? Um, I am very good. It's been a tough seven days without good old hubby Jack and Magnus. Unfortunately, the virus has been getting in the way of our three-way marriage. What kind of uh, music have you been listening to? A, a lot of Billy Joe Armstrong. Literally just Billy Joe Armstrong and the long shot. What's the long shot? It's Billy Joe Armstrong. Okay, fair enough. Oh, yeah, hello, <laughs> Ross Bob. Laughing at the chaos has been out for three days now. Are you excited, Reese? Very excited indeed. What is that picture behind you? The boys are from the darkness. I have the car as well. It's a Telecaster, original 1952. No, I need to try and put this back on the wall now. I have a cowboy hat. Fuck. You have a cowboy hat? Fucking sick. A cowboy classic. Yeah. Final question. <laughs> yeah. Is there anything on the other side? A whole lot of Billy Joe Armstrong. I must be going. I have cows to, to boy. Bye bye now. Now a word from Michael. Hello, Michael. Hello, Jack. Wait, I'm going to be on the next Kazakh thing. Oh, that's, that's pretty cool. How has your diet been for the last week? Literally nothing but like cheese toasties, oranges, and a very specific type of ice cream. I'm more of a soup guy myself. How are you enjoying the release of Laughing at the Chaos? It's a great song. Oh, I really like the um, synthy kind of effect with the guitar in the bridgey bit. Michael, if this wasn't an epidemic and it was instead a purge, <coughs> would you kill me? You've had the shit beaten out of you on multiple occasions, so you'd be a like, I'd try to keep you alive, but you would be a liability. Okay. Join a kickboxing class for fuck's sake, Jack. What is your favourite Kazakh song, Michael? Margarine or Laughing at the Chaos. We Excellent. will be releasing Margarine soon, so... What? You're releasing Margarine? Yeah. I can't wait for the studio version of Margarine, man. What the fuck? I can't I'm wait either. Before I go, 
Michael, yeah. do you have a message for the general public? Stay the fuck inside. Bye bye. Bye. We are here Hello. with my good friend Felix Glanville. Hello, Felix. Oh. Hello. What have you been doing in Plymouth to keep you entertained? Went for a walk today to Canterbury Creek and looked over longingly at my homeland of Cornwall. And how was it? Shit. It could be worse, right? Yes, because I could be in Italy. And that would suck. Well, apart from they make great pasta. They also have like a million different types of pasta. But well, maybe we should just go yeah. on holiday there. I mean, I can imagine the flight prices are pretty low. This is the perfect condition for us to go holidaying in. I will uh, pack my bags and wear my sun hat. I actually have a sun hat. Yes, I'll pack my sun hat. Do you have any comments for the general public before I go? Kazak is the most brilliant band that has ever existed. I only support the one and only Kazak. I ate some dandelion leaves. I ate a dandelion leaf and onions. Don't go outside. Don't do all of this. Don't go to the pub even though they're closed. Okay. Don't shave your hair because everybody's shaving their hair. Don't shave your hair. Well, thank you very much, Felix. Thank you, Jack. Laughing at the Chaos is out. I'm honestly really, really proud of this one. And honestly, it's eerily suitable under the circumstances. Hoping y'all enjoy it as the, uh, as the teen goes on. Stepping Stones is out this Friday, and we assume you're astute for this tune we have pruned and have strewn for you to consume and commune while cocooned in your room till we soon resume when June is in bloom. Okay? This is the hearty dum dum, spill a little dough, so push up all.